Today we're going to talk about things that sink or float. And Rachel is going to try some different items in an Easter egg for us. And we're going to see if they sink or float. So we have a plastic Easter egg and we've taped both ends of them since there's holes in there. And then Rachel is going to tell us how many items do we have, Rachel? We have four different items. And we're going to start with the first one. Go ahead. The first one is the eyeball. Yep, we're going to try an eyeball, not a real eyeball. <laughs> it's just something silly she has. Yeah. We're going to make sure it snaps closed. It's okay. It should be good. Give it a good try. And what happens? It floats. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and take that out. You will see what the other three are. Go ahead and make a mark under the float sign for me. Okay, and then what's the next thing you're going to try? I'm going to try erasers. Some erasers, okay. I have a butterfly, I have two butterfly erasers and two frog erasers. All right, let's put them in and see what happens. Will they sink or float? Watch. It, it will float because they're all four of them are not heavy enough. Okay, go ahead and take them out. And we'll go ahead and make a mark on our under our float sign. What's the next thing you have? I have paper clips. There's how many paper clips? There are 10 paper clips. Yep, go ahead and we're gonna go ahead and put them inside. Will they sink or float? I bet we're about to find okay. out. That's okay, go ahead and pick it up. These paper clips are tiny, so they're hard to work with. Did you get them all? You're about to find out what, where, whether it sinks or floats. It will float because it's not heavy enough. Ten paper clips are not heavy. Okay, go ahead and take it out. Oh, it didn't snap. Oh, they get a little bit water. That's okay. We'll go ahead and make our mark under float. Will the last and final one be sink or float? You're about mm -hmm. to find out. Okay, what do we have for our last one? I have money. You have coins. Not dollars, but we're going to put some coins in there and we're going to see if it sinks or if it floats. You can buy stuff with it, but only at a special place. Some of these are big, some of these are small. So we'll see if it makes a difference. Yeah. Okay, let's go ahead. That's okay. You gotta get it lined up just right sometimes to get it to snap closed because you the snap is the key. If you need some help, bring it here. I need help. Okay. All right, let's see what happens. If it sinks or if it floats. It's okay if you need help, too. That's right. It's always good to ask. 
it will sink. So we'll go ahead and take that out. It will go all the way to the bottom because it's really heavy. Yeah. Oops. That's okay. We'll get it in a second. Come back towards me. Why don't you go ahead and put the sink mark down and then we'll see how many we have. How many floats do we have? Three floats and then for sink we have one. Okay. One and then a three. All right. That's all we have. I hope you enjoyed our sink and float fun. Bye.